All right, so I wanted to show you guys the tires. We are about to go replace all four of them. They are pretty bald. They definitely need to be replaced. So. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I am going to go get my tires changed. Yes, there's still a few more projects that I need to do with this car before we take it on the road. It's just me, but I always want to make sure that everything is good with the car before I go on a long distance trip. So right now what we're doing is um, we're at Walmart. As you can see, I feel like we're always at Walmart, but we are at Walmart right now. We are going to be pulling some money out. Um, because I'm gonna give these people cash I don't know if they take cards or not but I found this little like small tire shop by this uh, mechanic place and it looks like a like a little like small business run by family kind of type of thing and and if you all know it is expensive to get altering tires especially for the vehicle that I have now I have a 2003 Cadillac Escalade which my tire size are 20 and I mean I searched Walmart Walmart doesn't have them they don't even carry that size the only people that do in this area is Les Schwab's uh, discount tires and who else oh and then this little auto place but if I was to go through them the tires are over a thousand dollars I mean you got to be kidding me me I'm like okay I gotta try to find it somewhere cheaper because I am not about to pay over a thousand dollars for these tires no I'm good so one day as I was driving by this mechanic place I thought you know what let's go ask them and see if they got this set of tires for this car sure enough they do so they're going to be charging me 550 for all four tires and then they're also going to be doing an alignment which is awesome so that's where we're heading now Okay, so we just got done with the tires so we are heading over to AutoZone right now and then also um, Friday I will be getting the spark plugs and the wires to get those done as well and then um, also while here I'm at AutoZone I'm gonna ask him about the battery I'm gonna see if there's like a little bit more powerful battery that I can that I can get um, for this vehicle but I mean otherwise than that the battery that is in it right now is good oh it looks like there's an accident up ahead. I'll show you guys. See? <sighs> Somebody wasn't paying attention. <clears throat> but yeah, definitely this car is, the tires are way better now. You know, it's probably not a good idea holding my phone while. Not too bad of an accident or whatever was going on back there but yeah so I'll check back in with you guys in a moment when I get all the quotes from AutoZone and see how much everything's gonna cost but I better pull my phone down because there's a cop smile okay let's go in this door all right, so we ended up stopping by Les Schwab. Um, I have an appointment actually tomorrow for one o'clock in the afternoon to come in so they can check out uh, my alignment. Um, hopefully it's not a bad situation, um, but if it is, I mean, regardless, it needs to be fixed. So I'm hoping it's still around the same price that this other guy quoted me. I'm hoping, but not including the, the parts that I'm gonna need. With the parts, I'm estimating somewhere like hmm, close to 500 something like that so 
we'll see um i'll let you guys know tomorrow what they say morning guys so it's the next day here in a couple of hours i am going to be heading over to les schwab i'm going to go have them kind of check on my alignment and have them give me a quote and see how things are looking underneath there if i'm going to need extra parts or maybe it's going to be simpler than that cheaper than that i do not know but i'm definitely going to keep you guys updated now i definitely don't have to worry about any snow if we do hit snow along our way there so it kind of makes me feel better knowing that all this stuff is getting changed that the car is going to be in excellent shape by the time i get done with it and knowing that i will have no worries on the road Right now I am here at Les Schwab, so here pretty soon I got to go in um, because my appointment's at 1. Um, and I'm hoping to God that this is not going to be too expensive, guys. I'm, oh God, keep your fingers crossed and hopefully it's not going to be too expensive. So, <sighs> all right, let's go in and see. So So I'm just sitting here waiting. Um, they said it's gonna take about an hour for them to look at my car. Um, I told them that I don't want any work done on it today. I just wanted them to look at it and let me know if there's any parts that need to be replaced. So it's just a sit and wait game. Oh, let's see, where do I begin? <laughs> Morning guys, today is uh, December 22nd, Thursday. So, as you guys all know, I went to Les Schwab's yesterday to get a quote for my alignment. I don't know guys, I don't know. It's not cheap, I'll tell you that much. So, I want to run by you guys um, the quote that Les Schwab gave me. Let me get my glasses on so I can see. Okay. All right. So for the alignment right now, I'm going to need a gearbox, a pitman arm, uh, a thrust alignment, I, I, you know, I don't know. I'm going to show you guys, if you guys can see. Hopefully, I know that's a little backwards, but this part he said we can do right now this is important but he goes it doesn't have to be done right now it could wait but it would need to get done the total is one thousand one hundred and fifty eight dollars and ninety seven cents that's what Les Schwab is charging me for the alignment to get it done on this car yeah so <laughs> just wait until uh oh I read you this other one so this morning I was called, well, let me back up. Yesterday when I got home, I was doing some more research, looking at more alignment places, seeing if there was anybody out there that maybe would do it for cheaper. I'm, I'm just, I was trying to get a different opinion on this before I decided to go with Les Schwab's. So this morning I had an appointment with Midas. As a matter of fact, as you guys see, Midas is just right behind me. Um, I just kind of wanted to get an opinion of what they said if they were going to like kind of quote me the same thing as Les Schwab. So basically I just wanted to get a second opinion. So, oh boy, yeah, I don't know, but let me cover up my address real quick. All right, you guys are not going to believe the price on this crap. I'm like, wow. I thought less oil was expensive. No. So they said I need a tie rod end, a pitman arm, outer tie rod end, Raymond steering gear, um, also power steering fluid, 
which I checked my power steering fluid, it was fine. Um, and then they're also quoting me for four set of tires. I just got tires on this car, so I'm like, what the hell? Honestly, I don't know if I trust them. But check this out, guys. So look at this. Here, let me cover my address here. But as you guys see, here's Midas. This is everything that they're quoting me. Now, look at this price. I My jaw almost dropped when I saw this. Look at that. Are you guys seeing this? $3,698.99. Almost $4,000 for what they're charging me. I mean, come on. I'm going to go with this one. <laughs> there's no way in hell I'm going to pay almost $4,000 for them to do it. And I... I don't know why they were quoting me tires. I don't need tires. I just literally put tires on it, as you guys saw. Wow, I was like, I was shocked when they quoted me this. I was like, no way am I gonna pay that price. No, no, no. So even though I don't wanna pay for this, for the, don't want to pay this price either for Les Schwab so but what it's looking like it's looking like I don't have an option I don't have an option but to pay it that's a lot of money guys that's a lot of money but like I said the vehicle is very important I need to make sure that it drives good I don't want any I don't want any problems with the alignment so I set an appointment with Les Schwab for this next week on December 30th to get this done. I'm only gonna do this part, uh, this top half, which is gonna cost me 1,158. Now this other bottom half down here that I have to do, this part, I'm gonna wait until taxes so I can take care of it then. Um, which I asked the guy, I said, would it be okay if I waited a couple of months for my taxes to come back and I can take care of the rest? And he says, oh yeah, he goes, that's fine. They're going to make it until then. So it's nothing that has to be done right this second week, but he said the alignment was very important. And I noticed because when I drive on the highway, the car does pull. So I definitely want to take care of that. I mean, this is the only car that I got that me and my family have. So... I can't afford to go buy a new one or anything like that. So I just got to take care of it. I got to take care of what I got. <sighs> Nothing is cheap. Nothing is cheap. I'll tell you that much right now. And, oh, it's stressing me out. I've been having a lot of anxiety lately. And lot of anxiety lately and it's because of all the stress um, so yeah guys that's the plan of what's going on guys thank you again for tuning into my channel please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed and hit the like button it would definitely tremendously help me right now um, but other than that guys I will definitely keep you guys updated on my life what's going on and let you guys know how this next appointment goes so guys thank you again for tuning in and we will see you guys on the next video